Okay, today on The Woodworks, I'm making peanut butter cup cookies. which are very similar to the peanut butter blossom cookies with the Hershey Kiss on top. Same concept, but we're gonna use this little mini muffin tray, which is really cute. And we're gonna use the little, uh, what are these called, Chance? Reese's peanut butter cups. Yes. Instead of the Hershey Kiss, the peanut butter cup's gonna go inside the cookie, push it down at the very end. But I will demonstrate all that, and let me run down the list of ingredients. It's one and three-fourths cup all-purpose flour, half a teaspoon salt, one teaspoon baking soda, half a cup of butter or one stick, half a cup of white sugar, half a cup of peanut butter, half a cup of brown sugar packed, one egg beaten, one teaspoon vanilla extract, two tablespoons milk, and 40 miniature chocolate-covered peanut butter cups, unwrapped. Do not stick them in the cookie with the wrapper <laughs> on. Chance is handling all that for me. Um, thank you, Chance. You're I'm just gonna sift the dry ingredients first. So that's just the, the salt, the baking powder, and the flour. Mm -hmm. ah. It's like we're just entering uh, a bakery in heaven. Like this would just be flowing and at a bakery in heaven. I wonder who else is sifting around the world right now. Somebody gotta be sifting right now, but do they enjoy it as much as me? Probably not. <laughs> Doubtful. Love this sifter. It's fantastic. Gets the job done nicely. Got my dry ingredients. I have my butter and my two sugars in here. So we're gonna cream them first and then add all the other wet ingredients. Okay, I'm gonna add the peanut butter and give that a mix. Gonna add the vanilla, the egg, and the milk. Gonna combine that gently. All right, so that's all nice and incorporated and smooth. Gonna add half of the dry ingredients. I'm gonna add the rest of the dry ingredients.
All right. So our cookie goes done, and done. Just gonna get it off the paddle and then give it a little mix with the spatula here. So I got my dough. Normally, I would refrigerate it for a couple hours, but we're keeping it moving here today. So I'm gonna take it, take the dough, and just like these little one inch kind of balls, and just put them right in each of these little muffin things here. Mini muffin tray, pretty cool. What happens with me with making cookies like this sometimes, I go back because the first few I did were either too big or too small. So I think I'm gonna have to do that. Like this one looks a little too small. So let's give it a little more dough. Okay, so these are gonna go in the oven. We're not gonna put the, these uh, Hershey cups things in them um, until we take them out the oven and they'll start to crack a little bit and that's when you know they're done. So they're gonna go in the oven for like 10 to 12 minutes at 375. There you go. And we'll be back in 10 minutes. Okay, the peanut butter cup cookies are done. Gonna take them out and then we're gonna put the, uh, these uh, Reese's, what are these called? Peanut butter cups into the cookie. Yeah. Oh yeah, looking good. Yeah. And now we're just gonna take these and press them down into each cookie. That's it. And that's it, and we'll be right back to give them a taste. Okay, the peanut butter cup cookies are done. Um, I know they're gonna be great. They're um, baked perfectly. The Reese's cup there is starting to melt. These are very sinful, but here we go. Oh man. Mmm. Fantastic. A little crispy on the outside. Soft and moist on the inside. Mmm. Mmm. Hold on. Mmm. There's chocolate on me. They are so good. I like these better than the peanut butter blossoms because it's a little bit of a double 
peanut butter thing you get. But this has a little less chocolate. I'm not big on chocolate. So they're just fantastic. I mean, I suggest incorporating these in your holiday cookies because they look really unique. And you just gotta get the little um, muffin mold thing. And you can use that for other stuff too. So they're fantastic. Try it at home. I'm really, really happy. They came out great. Um, make them with your kids and make them for the holidays.